<laughs> Good morning, everybody. This is Val with This Is How You Do It. I have on um, one of my towels with the arms in it, but I done put my arms in it because I'm finna put some color in my hair, y'all. Color. I still am doing the um greenhouse method with this, so my hair has been sitting under condition <coughs> er, all night. Now, I got this color from the Dollar Tree. It's black. This is the tube. This is a little thing that push it to ohm it up. Got a hole in it now. I got one of these from the hair store, I think. I think this costs like some cents. It's plastic or a dollar and some. You're supposed to put that behind your head, neck and like, you know how people wash people's hair in the, in the bed and, and color and stuff? Well, I don't know. Well, I'm going to use it. I'm going to put this color inside of here in one of the corners because I don't like using the bottle because I have to shake, 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 shake that bottle. And it and it be so thick, it hardly comes out and I just be beating my hand and it just is nerve-wracking to me. So what I'm doing is I am mixing it in this little container here. Yep, I got to get all this product out, y'all. You know how you bend it to the side to side to get the product out of it? Don't leave nothing. Don't waste nothing. See? I got it all out. Now I'm going to set this to the side. Put the top back on it because I don't know what's in this stuff. Well, I'm dropping it in the box. And this is the way it looks now. Okay, now I'm going to pull the, uh, this stuff right on top of that stuff you just saw. Well, what's it called? Okay, <laughs> I'm pouring that on now. I wasn't going to show y'all how to mix it together, but it may be somebody out there that don't even know how to mix up that, that come in a box, don't understand the directions, so I'm showing you how to do it. This is how you do it with Val. I just pulled all that out, drop it in the box, close your box up. You can dispose of it later. Let me show you. It's in there. Now you take your little thing here. Got that from the hair store. When I call hair store, it's the place where you buy your wigs at. That's what I call the hair store. I don't know if everybody call it that, but got to explain everything, y'all. So there won't be no misunderstandings. And now I'm mixing it together. And I got black. Jet black. I love I love the way black hair looks on my skin. It makes me look innocent. Won't hurt a fly. I tried that um blonde and I looked like I was about to do anything. Say anything. Act in a kind of way. Your girl was hot to trot. Mm-hmm, that blonde hair. <laughs> now, I do like that 1D30 when I used to get wigs. Because it they just had it in there like, um, like highlights. And it was so pretty on me, y'all. That 1D30, what you say? Yes, honey. That, your girl thought she was some hot, fine-looking stuff then. <laughs> And sometimes I really think about putting some, I don't even know what color you call that, that 30 on, on my hair. That's, that's just, that's the show number pretty, but I'm scared. But I say, Val, if I'm doing this, I can get this in a, in a 30. What you think? But it takes forever for our hair to, to start changing. You got to do it so many times. Because I don't want to put no bleach in my hair. I'm sorry. I've seen people do it, but I'm scared. Now, they send you some of these gloves with it. And here are your directions, y'all. But they don't do it directions. I've been doing my hair for so long, y'all. I don't need those directions. Now, I'm going to put these gloves on. And I do want to tell y'all, I still don't shampoo. And you, I bet you say, Thea, how you do your hair and you don't shampoo? And you got dye in your hair. What I do is when I go in the shower, I rinse it thoroughly. 
Just stand up in the shower, let the, let, the, let the black stuff just run all in the tub. And I put conditioner on my hands, and I washed my hair with the conditioner until the water, as it hit my head, when it hits the tub and it runs down the drain, and when the water starts running clear, there's no more dye in my hair, that's when I stop using the conditioner. But I let the water hit my hair until there's no more blackness in the tub. And I've been doing it, I'm, I'm, I'm going on four years natural, but I'm three and a half years natural, and my hair was like this. And when you see the length of my hair down to here, I've been dyeing my hair for every month for three and a half years, and I have not used shampoo. I use conditioner to wash my hair. Just saying. I don't know what these other girls do when they say they just use conditioner, they don't use shampoo. But your girl, don't she use shampoo. Not even when she dye her hair. I wash with conditioner. And my scalp don't have black stuff on it. And my hair don't have black stuff on it when I get through. And my hair is not falling out. I'm just saying. And right now I got conditioner on my hair. And this right here, you can call it a pre, uh, whatever, protecting my hair from the dye. You can call it whatever you want to do. I don't normally do this, but my hair needs color in it today. Because right here, it looks like I got a, a, a bald spot right here, but that's just gray. This right here, what you're seeing, that's not white condition. That's gray hair right there. And it's gray hair right here. And my part looks so big, but it's actually gray going right here to make that part look so big. So I'm going to dye my hair. Yeah, when I say my hair down in there, it is. And I have conditioned my hair for three and a half years. No shampoo. Dye, dye once a month. Dye, color dye. Yeah, and I just put it in. Especially the part that's going to show all the time. And the rest of it. It get it cause it get it, but the part that's gonna show all the time, and, it, and then the way I'm I'm wearing my hair, I get that right away. Cause the other don't matter. <laughs> I just want that that show. I move stuff over. I hate it when it drop on your on your on your towels and stuff. Cause when that get that black stuff get on some cloth, you know it don't come off. It sure don't. And as my hair grow, look like this don't be enough dye no more. But like I said, as long as I get the part that everybody see, that's what I be concerned about. Look at them curls, Chaz. Look at them. That conditioner doing this job. Let me show you. It's relaxing the curl of my hair. It's doing what it's supposed to do. Say, Belle, I didn't know conditioner was that powerful. Yes, it is, honey. Conditioner is a powerful thing. It sure made a believe out of me. That's for real. Now, y'all believe me if you want to, or you don't believe me if you want to. Conditioner changed the texture of my hair. I don't know about y'all, but... I, I let conditioner sit on my hair every night for six months straight until it relaxed my curl. And I did it in the summertime because I had a TWA. And when I got up every morning, I got in the shower, put conditioner on my hair, and, and stood on the shower and rinsed my hair out. Put oil after after I, I rinsed it out. And then style with a gel. Because I had a TWA, it was easy to do that every every day. And I said I'm going to start back because my hair had started looking bad. And I was saying, why is my hair looking so bad? And Tanya hair, my daughter, her hair looks so good. She conditioned a lot. She make her avocado conditioners and, and every kind of conditioner you can think about. Bananas. Well, the bananas now, you don't use whole bananas because if you use whole bananas, but the bananas get stuck in your hair. You go to... Uh, the baby food section and you buy those bananas 
in the baby food jar, and then that's what you use to to do your hair. All the baby food plastic containers, those are bananas that you use. I was lighting up the laptop. Y'all saw it hesitate. And did you see my face when it did that? I was like. <laughs> I'm putting this in. And y'all know how you do this. You put your dye in like you put your perm in. I believe it's every little girl my age to put dye and perm in their hair before. I don't know now. And the ones that coming up these days, they can do hair bed in uh, the beauty shop. Yeah, honey. And you say, babe, I ain't know you can put uh, dye in your hair and your hair already be wet. Child, it get wet when you put the dye in it. And then if you put a bag on it, it heat up. And the moisture get into it and, and activate it. So, and then there are some con there are some dye companies that put conditioner in it to wash your hair. Have you ever seen that? I have went and bought dye that the stuff they wash you wash your hair with is conditioner. Y'all should check into that. That y'all that don't know it that some companies have started to do to put the conditioner in it for those curly girls. Not not shampoo, just conditioner to wash your hair with. When I saw that, I was a surprised. I said, I do that already. I wash my hair with conditioner already when I dye my hair. I didn't know the company's hair got hip to it. Like I say, you think you think of something, and ain't nothing new on the sun. Y'all, I'm through with it now. It's all gone. And you know what? This thing right here, what I got, it rinse out clear when I, when you're through with it. Now I'm going to uh, rub it in. I'm trying to set it somewhere. Set it up there out of my way. Now, rub it in. I got the part where the root going to be at. And then you know how you tuck your ends. I don't mind it getting on the ends. Now, because it... Just like your perm put start from the root to the tip. The root to the tip. Let me turn around for you. I hope this thing don't keep hesitating. And then I'm going to come back and show y'all my hair, what it looks like once I rinse all of this out and I apply my gel. And the gel that I'm going to be using is Hawaiian Silky. And I will be doing the wet and wavy look again because look at your girl hair. Let the water run on your hair until the water runs clear in the tub. There's not one speck, speck of black dye in the tub. Wash until, that's when you start washing when, when you're using shampoo. Not shampoo, when you're not using shampoo. You stop rinsing your hair with the conditioner when the water runs clear. Go twist this, get it off my neck, and it'll probably fall on my neck anyway. Some will probably get around my ears, some will be on my forehead, and that will wipe off. So take these gloves off. So I can cut the computer off. I have already taken my eyelashes off. So they will be in my way in the shower. 
try to take them off then, because sometimes I let them go and get wet, then take them off and then trash them, but you know, because I ain't got time to be snatching stuff off my eyes while I'm sitting in here at the dish, you know what I'm saying. Just set them right here. Now, this is Val, but this is how you do it, and I talk to all of you beautiful people when I come out the shower and put this Hawaiian sick on my hair and get me the wet and wavy look. Bye-bye now.